Hello, I'm Kevin, EUC Upgrade, um, E-Ry Repair Shops. So, um, today I'll be showing you how to uh, fix the error 27 on your S22. So, if you try to upgrade your firmware on the S22, and after that, the wheel starts to tilt you know, forward and backward, and you can't ride the wheel. So, the wheel think the battery has a problem so this is due to an update on the battery and it failed on the firmware update and to fix this what you need to do is is to uh, take the battery out and reset the battery and after that you need to put it back into the wheel and redo the firmware update okay so on this video uh, I'll be looking at the battery on the S22 and uh, what I also find is uh, if you do get condensation on your battery that also gives your wheel an error as well which uh, it will not communicate with the battery and uh, uh, and then you can't ride the wheel basically because it's uh, uh, again the error 27 comes up as well because it's uh, it lost communication with the battery so uh, the error 27 means you lost communication with the battery and also when the battery crash halfway updating it you also lose the communications so this will give you an error 27 and uh, if you uh, watch my video on this one how to fix your wheel so uh, so don't miss anything on this video otherwise um, you won't be able to repair your error 27 so let's get the, let's have a look okay this is the s22 battery so let's have a look and look at that looks like we've got some stuff there Condensation. <sighs> look, condensation here, look. Condensation. Yeah. Okay. okay, this is the second King Song battery pack. Have a look. So this one is okay with no condensation. So this is the uh, battery and you can see the green light is flashing. Now to reset the error 27 on the battery, you have to find this hole here, the ground and the reset. And as you see there on the picture, what you need to do is put a link across those two holes to short circuit it and that will reset the battery. And then you will have to put it back into your wheel and do the uh, firmware update again and that will fix your problem okay that's it